officially crossed into a sign that says no trespassing. Tribal members only. Yeah. Pro tribal members only. So that's why we've got our guides up here. Well, Henry Little Light, Gus Old Bear. Hopefully they get nice and yeah, as you can tell, this road uh, is a little rough. It's been this way for about the last 20 miles. 28 miles of this. We haven't even seen a buffalo yet. We're, we're just getting to the top of the mountain. So. Wait till he turns. Just let him settle in. Nice job, Dad. First one, 2008, we're on our way. Good job, thanks for getting the stuff up here. Wow. I got more stickers in me than I ever want to have in the rest of my life. Just hit, I saw it 70 yards when I shot, maybe even 65, which is about perfect for what we had with the Hawken with the iron sights. We were concerned anything over that, we were going to have to go with the uh, top to center Omega, you know, because we didn't, we, the last thing we want to do is end up with a wounded animal. We don't have that. We we managed to get him. So now comes the the fun part.
Holy cow, Dad. He's dead. He's down. We right here. The, back over there. On top of that mountain over there. Maybe an hour ago. I uh, worked our way around here and we saw two bulls on, on this flat here. Came up right in the trees and he was walking right towards us once we got up there. And the old hawk and barked. Had it right on his heart. And, yeah, he didn't go. He didn't go 40 yards. Iron sighted hawk and struck twice. Huh? Yeah. 435 grain. 40 yards, that's about it. And there he is. Huge bull. Absolutely huge. Called a buffalo herd. We usually have them about 10, 12 miles down the road called a buffalo pasture. But during the summertime, in January, in December, they go back for the winter because they got a knack of going back to where they were born. But in the springtime, they'll stay in the pasture until their, the water runs out. They call it springs, springs that come out of the ground, and when it dries up, then they start looking for water. There's a place called uh, S Cabin, that's water, and commissary down here, about two miles up the road. And they'll come, and there's another water hole down here, and they'll come up and drink the water over here. But our job is that we got a spike camp up there called Stink Hill Spike Camp, skeleton crew, where we camp there during the summer and make sure that they don't go into Wyoming. And then next month, we're gonna have a buffalo roundup, so we're gonna be starting to head them back, back into the pasture for the buffalo roundup. And this bull is about a 14 year old. And 15, their horns start to shed like, and they start breaking off like a fingernail, breaking off. So then that's a little bit too old then. But right now, he got kicked out of the herd He's not doing his job, so he got kicked out, so he's all by himself with another bull, probably a companion. So and then after we got this one, so the other bulls have to pull back to the herd. But this is a bull that has passed his prime, 14-year-old. What do you think uh, estimated body weight on this guy? Yes, that's about 23, 24, 2500 pounds.